Hey guys, and welcome back to Front Mission. Let's continue, shall we? I've restocked everybody and I've upgraded Molly's mech to be pretty much on par with everybody else's. Now, let's continue. I won't ask where you people have been. Now, listen up, here's your next mission. You are to seek and destroy all enemy patrols along the Mal or Mail River. Once you've secured the area, the army will move to liberate the nearby settlements. Ah, the army boys too afraid to get some mud and guts on their shiny wanzas. Why are we always doing their dirty work, huh? That's because you're mercs. You and everyone else in this room are expendable. If you don't watch your mouth, I can see that you're expended first, Keith. Now that we've made that clear, get the hell out and do what you're being paid to do. Dismissed. Right, also... Uh, here's the mission intel. Now that Wanza there is a self-contained unit. You can actually get one of those towards the end of the game. And you can't upgrade it. You can just, um, uh, you know, you just equip it as a piece of equipment. And it is what it is. It is monstrous. Absolutely monstrous. It's basically Ed 209. And uh, yeah, we're, we're hopefully going to be getting it. Now, there is one hidden mission that we've already missed. Um, I found out what I was doing with the guide to get the hidden missions. Uh, I was looking at the wrong <laughs> guide. I was looking at the hidden missions for the other, uh, other team. Yes, the guide for some reason had the hidden missions not all together in one section they were spread over in two par different parts of the guide um, which was strange so we've actually have missed the first um, mission that that is optional unfortunately however I am gonna fire up my new game plus mode and I'm gonna play all the way up there and add that mission in after this one so let's go I don't think we've missed anything else yet now there's also another secret mission that we are able to do now and it's the secret mission that I actually managed to do myself but we're not going to be doing it just yet because from what I remember it's actually quite tough. Um, I am going to start leveling up some of my guys in the arena because we need some more skills yeah. That's a lot of hostiles. Of course, if we get across, we'll be standing on UCS soil. And their morale will take a big hit. I see. It also means the OCU has to get through at any cost if they want to win. This place, I... <gasps> Flashback. Ryuji, the intruders are retreating, Captain. It looks like we're the only ones left again. For once, you're wrong, sir. The new recruit is still standing. Lieutenant Manure, report. I've taken heavy damage, but I'll make it back. Captain, should we call for an emergency evac? Ow. Oh, it's so cringy. Ugh, your vital signs are low. Uh, Karen, are you hurt? It's nothing, sir. Please fall back before reinforcements arrive. Lieutenant, eject your pilot pod. We'll carry you home. No, sir. We can't waste any of our wanzas. It'll be fine. Even though that wanza is trashed. That's an order. You take president over a piece of hardware. Sir, no need to shout. I've seen too many of me, my people die. I'm not taking any chances anymore. Wanzas are easy to replace. Pilots aren't. Captain, I'll comply, sir. Oh, God. So bad. It's delicious cheese. Karen, we protected this border together. How ironic is it that I'm the one to breach it? 
They've got floaters. Don't stand around the river. They'll catch up too fast. Well, you say they've got floaters. Um, I think we're going to leave Molly behind. Yep, let's go. Yeah, Molly's kind of like last. <laughs> She's just... Ugh, I don't like her as a character at all. Right, let's go. Let's perform. Get into some kind of position here. So we need to take this whole bridge. Now, you can of course go over the bridge. But personally, I find the bridge a bit of a bottleneck. So we're just going to go straight through the water. Now, of course, we're going to wait for all of our wanzas to form up in a line. So we can assault it. In a smooth motion. Because personally, I always think the bridge is a bad call. Although you can easily overpower the bridge. Because there's only a few wanzas on there. It just makes more sense to me to just go through the river. Damn the torpedoes. Full speed ahead. Okay. That will do. Not the most elegant formation. Yeah, they got one of those big things. Now, luckily those big mechs aren't really much to worry about in the enemy's hands. It's more when they're in our hands. Or should I say, we get one in our hands. And uh, it's deliciously meaty. It's got a cannon and a machine gun. And that machine gun... <laughs> oh man, especially when you're skilled. I mean, look at it. It's basically Ed 209. I'm sure it's a nod to Ed 209. I hope it is. And if it is, then I think that's fantastic. Anywho, let's keep pushing. Wait a minute. I wonder, actually, with our the type of... No, we can. We, we should be able to go through. I was wondering, actually, because I, I don't think last time I played this, I played with tracked wheels. Or I might have done. It might have been the time I actually played it on my 3DS. I didn't play with tracked wheels. Because I thought they looked a little bit silly. But they're actually pretty bloody good. So the plan is to just bum rush across. Uh, pretty sure Pee Wee can cross the river as well. Now those wanzas that are going to come in behind us, they're pretty meaty. But, you know, I'm not going to worry too much about them. Oh, hi. Wow, Missile has literally just like run up to us. Um, I think I said I did restock everybody. Yeah, he's literally going to hit us with the rockets from long range. That's fine. Look at the little mechs. The little mechs are just so adorable. And the music here is really, really good. Okay. So, you know what? Take a volley at the missler, I guess. Uh, sure, just go for the body. Unfortunately, the frame rate really tanks really hard um, on this level, which is disappointing, but uh, it is what it is, I guess. Just keep going. Get that gun skill. Damn it, Frederick. I'm not losing another pilot. Not that I've, you know, technically lost anyone yet, but hey. Oh, God. Awful. Awful. You guys, honestly. Right, you can keep pushing up. Um. I mean, I guess we could fire a volley just to soften this guy up. If we take him out, we take him out. Okay. That's fine. 
Uh, Oldler, I want you to get into formation. Everybody else can kind of just hold the line here for now. Pee Wee can get into position in case. Um, just end your turn. Here we can get in position just in case we need to reload missiles, which we probably will. Ah, oh, come on, somebody, somebody crack that armor. In fact, I'm pretty sure he's not even that armored. JJ, mess him up. Uh, why is there a cat coming across my desk? Uh, no, 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 no. Oh god, cat, you fat sack of cuteness. Oh god. You know you're not allowed on my desk. <sighs> the list of rules we have for you is, is shockingly small. Oh no, Fred. Fred! Oof, this could be bad for Fred. Actually. Maybe. We need to get Fred patched up. Yeah, good. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. We really need to get Fred sorted. Um, that's an attacker. You know what? No, we can't actually get there, can we? You know what? I guess... I guess go for the commander. Go for the body. Now, I don't think water counts as very good cover, but I could be wrong. Commander and attacker. Yeah, I guess just go for the commander then. Go for the body shot. We don't care about attackers. We can let those get close to us. That's fine. Right, Natalie. Natalie's in relatively good shape. Ah, oh. well, I mean, yeah, you know what? Break the line. Right, you attack. The good thing with their rifles is they do a disgusting amount of damage. Fred, you you just need to sit on a repair, mate. <laughs> That's basically all you can do. Um, you know what? Try and soften these guys up. Really? Really? I guess if they're in range, let them have it. That'll do. That'll do. Old luck, come back. Can you soften this eye up? I guess you can soften this guy up. This is good. Right. I was gonna say. Ah, he's a missler. Right. Ah, oh, dude. Gregorio. I mean, dude, come on. Were you even trying? Oof. All that stings. But he got some good XP for that. Alright, he's covering his friend's ass with chaff. I mean, that's kind of a waste of a turn, really. Yeah, piss off and repair. Interesting. Even though those guys were engaged, they're not actually doing anything. That's curious. Mayhew has taken a bit of a batter in there. We do need to take that big mother out. So. Um, right. I'm going to go just get in the thick of it. I guess. Let's go for you. See if we can't take you out. Or at least do some heavy damage. Which is fine. Um, how close into the combat can we get? 
All these attackers, man. I guess just soft. Ah, oh, right. Go for the commander. Um. I guess just go for the arm. Or, you know, go for the rocks behind the commander. You know, either or, I guess. Nice. Not bad, Nat. Not bad. See, she's actually getting some decent short range. If we can get everybody up to like 2,000 XP. I think that would be quite a juicy step in the right direction. Now, we can attack. Let's go for the commander again. Come on. I want to get that rocket launcher off him. I mean, that's... That's something, I suppose. JJ... Go for you. Ah, oh, JJ. Honestly. Oh, JJ's. That might have been a really bad mistake. JJ might be going down. Maybe. Unless. We can get some supremely good hits on this commander and take him down. Alright, mate. Uh, Paul, uh, I kind of want you to join those guys, but can you? You can attack the commander. Do that then. Not fantastic. Old, old boy. Can you make it happen? Of course you can't. Obviously. Why would I assume that you could make it happen? Right, you start volleying some more rockets at this guy. There we go. That's why we pay you guys the big bucks. Yes, right, one down. That will do. Now, Pee Wee, just gonna wanna get you into the action there, brother. Now, I'm hoping... Okay, that's fine. Oof. Oh, that hurts. Yeah, that stings. That stings. But that's okay. Okay. My uh, XP is kind of creeping up there a bit. I don't know why I named that character after me, actually. I don't know. It's a bit weird. After the channel name. Oh, this is going to suck massive amounts of penis. Oh, they played a, played a hard game there. Oof. Okay. I genuinely think going evasive there saved the day. Right, back up. Hit that mother with everything we have. <sighs> now these guys, as we can see here, are not the toughest thing in the world. But. They're not fun. Alright, not bad, Natalie. Let's see what you can do. You can do very little. It would seem. Um, it's fine. We're just gonna keep. We're gonna just keep grinding short-ranged damage. Right, JJ. Now listen to me here, brother. You're gonna get the fuck back and use your repair kit. <laughs> JJ always seems to take um, <laughs> large quantities of damage. War is not kind to JJ. Okay, let's move up. Alright, you know what? Take some shots. That was pathetic, but luckily you didn't actually get hit back, so small mercies and all that. Okay, so what are we like? You've got sweet FA missiles. So go res... No. 
go restock. Oldler, yeah, you know what? Resupply. Now, these two guys, which are doing the uh, advancing, you. If you guys can actually break the lines, I'll be reasonably happy. I don't mind if you take a few hits in return. Okay, cool. Pull your damage. Okay, it's not what we're looking for exactly, but I'll allow it. Oof. My word. Trouble is, he's going to retreat now. Okay, here they go. Whoa, you're engaging? Close range? I mean, alright. If that's what you want to do. That's more what you'd expect a missile to do. Okay, those guys can go regroup. That's fine. Although I'd rather not give them the chance. This is where things get a little bit delicate. We're outnumbered there. Don't really want to be outnumbered. To be honest. Take him out. It's another piece off the board. Uh, now Ryuji. Can we get Natalie to come behind? Ooh! Nat oh, Natalie! Oh, Natalie. Right, we need to do something about you now. Yeah, that'll work. That will work. Whew, Keith really saved ass there. Right, I want you to stay there. Fred, you're alright. Everybody else should be set to assault. What we like. Two volleys. Two volleys is fine. Paul. Paul's only got one, so you can resupply. You're fully topped up. You can get back into the fight. And send a volley his way. Oh, well, one missile launcher down. That's better than nothing. Now, hands. I actually want you to keep working this guy over. Go for the body. There we go. That will work. It's not elegant, but it will work. Now, Gregorio has taken a nasty knock. Very nasty knock, actually. So, I'm going to say just fix yourself up. And wait for reinforcements. Now, Ryuji... Oh, you got one volley left. That sucks. Alright, go rearm. So their line is crumbling. As it should. Damn, we need better missiles, don't we? We really do. Alright, he's retreating with his tail between his legs. So's he, actually. Curious. Well. Rob, how many missiles? One volley. Oof. Alright. So. Get some repair action going. Let's get that right arm sorted. Right, resupply. Yeah, it's so much. Oh, God. That's really screwed. That's better. Keith's in pretty good shape. Only missing one load of rockets, so that's fine. Right, okay, so yeah, you literally just have to have them. Um, next to the supply truck to actually repair destroyed components. I didn't know that was a thing. I know they slowly regenerate health. I know that, obviously. But I didn't 
think that they completely repaired broken parts unless you um, had the parts in stock, which is interesting. And I like the way, although it's hard to see, and you're probably definitely not going to see it on YouTube, which is such a shame, such a little detail. The mechs are actually um, getting splashed with water. I've never noticed that before. It looks actually quite a sweet little effect. Right, okay, let's get you back in the fight, brother. Use item. Let's get your right arm repaired, I guess. Now, Fred. You know, Fred's got two loads of missiles. That's fine. Uh, and so has May. That's fine. Paul. Paul's now in tip-top shape. Get into the fight. Now. Old Luck can keep moving as well. Old Luck actually can put a volley at this guy. Alright, I mean, a hit's a hit, I guess. Right, hands. Hands. Can start getting handsy. Ha, ha, ha. With this guy. Start getting some short range XP. Same as you, Gregorio, my friend. I mean, we destroyed their... It's a shame, really, like... If you destroy their generators or their... I don't know what you call them. Like, hover legs, I guess. It's a shame that doesn't... Um... Right, you. You've got missiles. You don't, so let's move you to there. It's a shame they didn't just crash and sink and become immobile. I mean, I guess that would be OP, but whatever. Oh, here he comes. That was a mistake. You're going to get ground into the um, ground, my dude. Alright, Ryuji, let's go. Ooh. Can we get a cheeky little sniper shot on his ass? Maybe. Yeah, the frame rate literally goes into the single digits here. He's got really decent long range skill. I think the skill makes you do more damage with weapons. I've kind of noticed that, I think. But it doesn't increase your chance to hit or anything like that. At least from what I can tell. Um, whether you... Um, have maxed out weapon skill or not you still miss and rockets just always seem to be inherently inaccurate no matter what skills you use definitely want to engage this guy long range don't want to give him the uh, satisfaction of getting up and close because if that happens we're gonna have a bad time We are giving him a beating, mind. Not enough of a beating. I mean, his legs are disabled now, so he's going to literally be limping along uh, without any real way of getting at us. There we go. He's junk. Because he's junk, let's try and engage hand to hand if we can or at least close in of course there is no hand to hand in this game oh what an idiot of course there's hand to hand there's melee you bell end yeah you know what you're talking about titan's a fake gamer you heard it all here right okay let's keep moving up push everybody through. Well, now I want to get short range kills. As much as we like the rockets, and the rockets are great for softening people up, we really need to start working on our short range kills. Come on. <laughs> uh, not quite what we were looking for, May, but you know. Oh, is it worth it? Do we want to risk him getting repaired? Oh. 
fine. I don't think he's going to be able to get repaired anyway. It's just going to be too slow. That's what we want. 110 XP. Alright. Gregorio, let's get you going. So I'm definitely looking forward to um, Front Mission 2, which apparently is still on track to come out this year. So I'm pretty hyped for that. Wait, he did repair his damage parts. Okay. Curious. I've never noticed them actually repairing damage parts before. Or did they? If we take a shot at him. Uh, yeah, I think they did. But instead of waiting there to get like a decent amount of repair, um, all he did was just wait until he got like a little bit of health. Which is interesting. Well, I guess they never really improved the AI. Which I suppose makes sense. <laughs> they kept it extremely faithful to the original. Which is fine. Yeah, I would have liked to have seen them do a little bit more, personally. Especially, eh, visually maybe. Alright, let's sneak everybody around. Yeah, you guys are screwed. You know it. I know it. You all know it. Your legs are gone. You're just a slow crawling husk now, my dude. Now, can we? No. Let's just wait to get everybody in range. He's going to try and come back into combat. He's going to get himself patched up. <laughs> He's hightailing it the hell out of there as well. Okay, what are we looking at? This dude. Oh, don't actually want to hit him with the rockets. Unless. Uh, you do actually have guide. Okay. Don't want to really go for a rocket hit. Unless we can actually use guide. Because, like I say, we really need to start. Do you have guide? Everybody should have guide. Because we can still get a little bit of rocket XP. Uh, we need to get rid of that nasty armor of yours. All right. Okay, right, Keith, move up. Waste his ass. Keith! Really, Keith? Come on, Keith. Ugh, honestly. Yeah, we're not going to use rockets on him. But. Come on, get the kill, Fred. There we go. 172 XP. Not bad. Not bad at all. God, that was bad. Alright, these guys are basically padlocked in. You're hosed. I would say I suggest surrendering, but we're not going to accept to surrender, of course. What would be nice is if we were in range of the... Yes! Excellent. Let's get rid of that. Don't mind wasting missiles on this thing. That is acceptable. Okay, here we go. Oh. Ooh. Oh, he's just completely taken May out of the fight. That was... I'm not even mad about that. Not even mad about that. I should have really done some due diligence there. Right. How much health has this dude got? Not much. 
would be the answer. So, Gregorio, get around there. Lay it on him. That was actually completely and utterly useless. You might lose your gun there as well, Greg, but that doesn't matter. Not really. Who's that? Hands. Hands can get in. Hands, you've got that. We like that. Now, I don't think anyone else is going to be able to get around. Ah, uh, you know what? Finish him off, I suppose. Oh! Get rid of his rocket launcher. Ah, oh, dude! Seriously? Bloody useless, honestly. Yeah, he's still got the egrets. And of course she's got guide. So, use guide. Can you remove that egret launcher? You can. Excellent. Um, 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 um you know, I guess really. You also have guide. I'm guessing. Yeah, you can. You can hit that. Go for it then. Yes. No way of repairing now, me laddos. Ah. Uh, I guess. You don't have any skills. Alright, so. Just gonna end your turn. Fred, you don't have any skills either. So, you're going to just end. May's actually got double. That's interesting. Shame she's completely out of fooked. Alright. You know what? Screw it. Just take him out. If nothing else, we're just going to soften them up. I mean, we might. Yeah, I was going to say, we might get a lucky shot. And I suppose XP at the end of the day is XP. Whatever. Oh, one last act of defiance from our missile friend. Can we make the magic happen? Can we? Well, yeah, we can. We disarmed him. So, I guess. But, looks like we're going to go for a missile kill. Otherwise, this match should go on forever. Where well, it really doesn't have to. There we go. Oh, can we? There we go. This should be a kill shot. Maybe. Yep, that'll work. That'll do, Donkey. That'll do. Area secure, sir. All reinforcements are arriving at the front. It's only a matter of time until we secure neighbouring areas. You're welcome. What did you say, Keith? Didn't say nothing, sir. Oh, Keith. You and your cheek. So we got a decent amount of scratch for that mission. Happy with that. Yeah, we got like 20k. And I suppose if you take into consideration repair parts, we probably got more than 20k. Now, what I'm going to do, guys, um, I am going to save the game, obviously. And I'm going to replay on my New Game Plus um, save. Oh, shit, I don't even have that anymore. So I'm going to have to... Yep, so I'm going to redo that. And I'm going to start leveling some of our guys up as well because we're kind of... We've got level 18s. All the way down to level 5 with Molly. Don't know if I'm going to bother leveling Molly up. I mean, maybe I will. I'm not sure. But maybe if I can get people up to at least about... I guess level 15, depending on how much I can be bothered to actually do it. We'll see. So, we're going to save the game. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.